Hey guys, it's Donovan Reyes. I am in Cadence at the Symmetry Meadows community. This is by DR Horton. We're checking out the townhomes today. This one is the 1195. Turn this. So we got the 1195 floor plan that we're going to be viewing today. Two bed, two bath. Located in Cadence, which is in Henderson. You got the pavers. Nice stucco on the outside. Tile roof. So this is part of their Express, or Dior Horton Express, uh, one car garage. The Express is um, where everything has already been selected for you. So you don't have to worry about picking out cabinets, hardware, flooring. It's all done, so it makes it quite easy. A little stress-free, I would say. So the model home has a lot of upgraded stuff, which you would not get. So like all this wood accent here, it's very nice. But kind of gives you an idea of what you can do to the property. So directly to the left, you the bathroom, but we'll start here at the bedroom. This is a guest bedroom here. Two windows, ceiling, or you got a light there for a ceiling fan or if you wanna just leave the light. Closet is a little bit bigger than what you typically see, a little wider. So you can see probably a full-size bed here with um, nightstand on each side. Dual pane windows. And what I like about these windows, are these tabs on the newer homes, or newer windows, you can pop these off and uh, take this panel out so you can clean the outside of the window. So, I mean, you can do that from the outside of the house, but if you're on a two-story home, it makes it much easier. You got the fire sprinkler there. So if there's a fire in, for example, this room, the fire sprinkler will pop off in here instead of hosing down the entire house. This is your laundry. So stackable washer and dryer. So it comes with granite countertops, white shaker cabinets. The deep tub. This is a fiberglass insert. Pretty good ceiling height throughout the whole house. Coat closet. There you would put your router. I like that there's a little bit of a hallway before you walk into the living area and kitchen. So plenty of can lights and good amount of windows. Here is the garage, it's an office right now. It's a one car garage. So a good size pantry for this house. Shaker cabinets. They're dovetailed, so that's nice. They are not soft close. It's an easy upgrade. I did that at my house, bought them from Amazon. A little hardware. So this is vented out, that's a nice feature. So it does come with the appliances you see. So plenty of countertop space and cabinet space. Nice stainless steel undermount sink. This is the overflow or the, uh, the drain. So if this is the dishwasher backed up, it'll come out from here. You got your water softener for purified water and then your regular. Oh, it's closed. Garbage disposal with the switch right here. Your dining area. So as you can see, you comfortably fit a four-seater. I would say you can even put one on each side to make it a six-seater. 
We have a good amount of people here. A uh, couch over there, two nice chairs, and then you still got two stools here. So you can definitely entertain a decent amount of people here. A full view of the kitchen. Again, front door there. But nice open floor plan, which has become really popular lately. Show you guys the backyard at the end. Here is an office. It's a den. You have a stage as an office. I would make this probably an office and have like a little area for a bar. I had somebody consider closing this up and putting a door to make it another guest bedroom. One thing I noticed about these are the doors are the door uh, frames are a little bit wider, which is nice. So say if you're in a wheelchair, makes it easier to get in and out. Here's the primary bedroom. Good size. You got nightstands on each side. Gives you a view of the backyard. So a primary bathroom. So again, granite countertops throughout, shaker cabinets. This one has a walk-in shower. You got a walk-in closet. Really good size. So you got three rods and three shelves. You can customize this after you close and make a lot more use out of this. An attic space up there. I like having the walk-in closet inside the bathroom. To me, it makes it way more convenient. Let's go check out the backyard. Like the glass door, lets in a lot of natural light. Covered patio, which is part of the actual structure. So I like this design because you can put, say if you want to put a heater above, you can, unlike the aluminum ones, you can't do that. So it'll burn. So when you purchase a property, it'll come with all just dirt so in the model home, again, they kind of just show you the potential. So great big open floor plan. And this comes with the house. It's almost like an Alexa, but you can control everything. Select arm system type. No, we don't want to arm the house. But you can turn off the lights, turn on the lights, lock the doors, unlock the doors. It's through ADT. And it's also your thermostat. Oh. There's a camera. Very nice. But yeah, it's a one car garage, insulated garage doors, MyQ garage door opener, and tankless water softener. Garage is right through there. Bring your groceries in. But yeah, this is going for around 365,000. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, my contact info will be in the description below. I'll show you guys the exit. Very nice. All right, talk to you guys soon.